I think my colleagues in, uh, across Europe feel exactly the, the same thing. We could be part of your outreach army. Oh, so our um, 800 or so members, uh, large and small, um, have a huge variety of um, practical expertise in both the development of the technologies themselves, but the deployment of those technologies in a, in a variety of different markets, right across economy and society, right across the public sector and the private sector. So um, using, using that group to pick up the messages, to amplify them and to put them into practice is a trick that surely can't be missed. an important part of any modern economy. So in a sense, part of the digital agenda is to get an economy and a society to embrace digital technologies as part of that economy and society. So to be an important engine for growth, to provide the jobs for young people. For instance, we in the UK, we estimate at the moment that over the course of the next parliament, uh, for us next five years, um, there'll be a shift from uh, public sector jobs to private sector jobs. That's what we're all hoping for anyway. So we could see as, as many as a million jobs move from the public sector to the private sector and then another million jobs be created in the, public, in the private sector as well. So two million new jobs. We think as many as a quarter of those could be in ICT if we had the right sort of policy environment. So important that in the UK we pick up on the digital agenda to help make ICT an important part of our economy in the next five years. But I think there's another aspect to ICT and that's ICT in a sense as a power tool to um, affect other parts of the economy and some societal issues that we need to get to grips with. Let's just look at two. So in a sense ICT powering the economy, the resurgence of manufacturing, uh, financial services, it's an important role to play in helping those other industries really prosper. But we also have an important role in helping society and the economy reduce their overall carbon footprint. And that's something set out in the digital agenda. It's part of Digital Europe's programme and I think is something that in the UK offers great opportunity for technology companies in the four or five years ahead.